It is the sign many Americans look for while shopping for a new appliance, an air conditioner, a refrigerator, a TV. The Energy Star label that tells you which model saves the most energy and, of course, the most money. But look what happened when federal investigators put the system to the test. Here's Elizabeth Leamy. When you see the Energy Star seal on a product, you think you're saving energy and money. But now the reputation of the 18-year-old program has come into question. The American public has a right to know what the program is and isn't at this point. And right now, for many of the products, it's a self-certification process. Government Accountability Office investigators set up four fake companies, complete with websites and submitted Energy Star applications. Fifteen bogus products were awarded the Energy Star seal, including a foot-and-a-half-high gasoline-powered alarm clock and an air purifier that was actually a space heater with a feather duster glued on top. Our air purifier with a feather duster on top of a space heater is a pretty ridiculous product that was easily certified. The GAO's products were fake, but the implications are real. Recently, LG and Kenmore were caught selling refrigerators with the Energy Star label that did not actually meet the standard. So I spent $2,500 on an appliance thinking it was going to help reduce my electricity costs and reduce my global warming footprint, and it doesn't even come close. The government says it will now start testing products before awarding the coveted Energy Star seal. Elizabeth Leamy, ABC News. Washington. And you can learn much more about the real deal of saving money and energy in your home by going to our website. The address, of course, abcnews.com.